The Dream SMP is a private SMP server owned by the Minecraft YouTuber Dream, with several different streamers and YouTubers including but not limited to Dream, Skeppy, Technoblade, Wilbur Soot, Tommy Init, George Not Found, Sapnap, Bad Boy Halo, Nikki Nianchu, Quackity, Jay Schlatt, Ponk, Fundy, Hubbo, Carl Jacobs, and Eret. This is part two in a series, and you know, if you want to watch the first video, I'll put the link in the description. But before we start this video, I'm gonna do a funny bit because all the YouTubers do it, and I'm really gonna do. Parker, as your editor, you are not allowed to do the bit. You are, you are not allowed. No, no. I'm the owner of this channel. I can do the bit if I want. So I've noticed that only a small percentage of you are liked and subscribed. So if you would like to. The point of divergence of the age between the Lemanberg Wars and before the Lemanberg election crisis, the major events during this time were the Pet War. The Pet War started when Sapnap on August 25th decided on a whim to mess with Nianchu's fox, Fungi. Sapnap then began shooting his bow around Fungi for fun. However, he accidentally shot the fox on the fish shot and turned into this a pile really of smoke. Close to... This is really close to... <gasps> Nikki then flew into what I would call a very, 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 very scary rage. She's kind of scary. He's dead. Who, who did that? Oh my god, oh my god! A uh, sound nap. Why did he do that? Because he's, he's, he's just, he's looking, he's looking to mess with you. I am so angry right now. <laughs> oh god, I'm a little... I'm gonna be honest, I'm a little scared right now. I've not. What the fuck, man? I've never seen. This rage was so great that Tommy, who had no involvement in the killings, agreed to grief Sapnap's house and stole two fish out of it, known as Beckerson and Mars, and then putting them in his e chest. Mars? Tommy, I oh, I just found them. Found I found them. Tweet. I have one bucket. I Fundy, also being a very, very cute furry, very attached to Fungi himself, decided to convince Nikki to take revenge. He convinced Nikki to kill one of Sapnap's foxes in retribution. This made Sapnap very, very angry, and Nikki very, 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 very sad. <laughs> Do it again, 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 again. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Sapnap being very salty. Even though by definition, he literally brought this upon himself. Decided to kill Fundy's Enderman. And things gradually got worse and worse. Dream then intervened and decided to hide all the animals away. However, Fundy and Nianchu took these precious pets hostage. However, Sapnap in retribution blew up Fungi's grave. And Fundy, being enraged by this, then decided to call Sapnap out and challenge him to a 1v1, to which he lost. But in a sign of good faith, both sides stood down, and this ended the pet war. Wilbur Soot, then president of Lemanbrook, decided that because he had not been elected, he hadn't had enough legitimacy for his office of president of Lemanburg, therefore he was going to hold an election. He decided to set up the campaign called Pog 2020 with his running mate, Tommy Innit. Initially, they tried to hide this from everyone else, but in the coming days, another campaign would start, run by Quackity and Georgia Not Found, known as Swag 2020. I am going to run against you, Wilbur, and I what? don't fucking care. Oh, what do you mean? What do you mean you're gonna run against us? You're not even part of the man bug. What? I don't care. Also during this time, that wonderful golden retriever of a person, Tabo, lost his mind and became an alter ego known as Big Law. I'm done, Nussie.
Well, this is awkward. <laughs> it's fine. There's, there's, nothing's awkward in front of the law. Big Q. You don't know nothing about He's big law, Trevor. Yeah, no, I'm talking about big law. Oh, that really changes Tom. my you opinion on you. Don't oh, worry. is that a felony? Is that a felony? I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> Another campaign started at this time, Coconut 2020, with Fundy and Nikki running. The parties had a few endorsements. YouTuber Vicstar endorsing Pog 2020, and Call Me Carson endorsing Swag 2020. Trying to secure another endorsement, they invited a man back onto the server to which they would soon regret. Jay Schlatt, the star of SMB Live, then logged back onto the server. He had been banned recently because of random things involving Twitter stands. However, he logged back on to the server and was there to endorse Pog 2020. A very senile and kind of intoxicated Schlatt then endorsed Coconut 2020 in confusion and then declared that he'd be his own president. Endorsement. Air endorsement. Come on, big man. <laughs> Hello? Hi. Hello. Hello. What is this? <laughs> Our endorsement, this is, everybody! This is the Jay Schlatt! The, the president of, of Lamanberg, Schlatt. You know what Lamanberg is? Oh god, that's dreadful. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's... You know what's... You know where you are? Do you, do, you, do you have an idea where you are right now? Montauk. India Pale Ale. <laughs> Our endorsement for, for Our endorsement say it, say it, just say it, just say it, say it, say it, say it, please. What, what am I? The, the what, Pog, what we're Pog, we're Presidency, Presidency, we're Pog 2020. Presidency, Presidency for Lamanberg, yeah, Presid this nation. Presidency. Yeah, yeah, Presidency. Yeah. Yeah. Presidency yeah. for Lamanberg. Who's yeah. this? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's me, babe. Don't call me that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Democracy is overrated. <laughs> oh, no, no. Oh, wait, wait, no. You, you want to say? Yeah, that's right. That's just right. stick to the, you don't, please, you the think script. You think you need a president? You think you need? I'll be my own president. <laughs> no, no, no. 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 Okay, no. Stick, stick, stick to the script. Stick to, uh, and and, and this was our endorsement from <laughs> Jay Schlatt. <laughs> Here I was unbanned. Back forever, everyone. <laughs> get off the. Get off the. <laughs> I was then endorsed by Dream, and then he decided to murder his political opponents. You know, like regular politicians do, by killing their political opponents. You know, that's that's regular, you know, that's that's normal. Into the bunker, into the bunker, into the bunker! Get in, get in, get in, get in, Me gusta, me likey, no me amo! Here's what I'm thinking. Chat, chat, uh, the guys, oh god, Jay Slats out. Let's, let's, okay. let's bother up the doors, bother up the doors. What I'm thinking, what are we thinking, guys? This is what I'm thinking, this is what I'm thinking. What are we thinking? Oh, oh, oh. No, just, what are we, it's go, go on, Wilbur, go on, please. What, oh, are, you, what are you thinking? We need to, we, how do yeah. we beat, how do we, oh god, he's there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. oh, okay, no, okay, no. okay, okay, keep, 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 keep talking, no. keep talking. Okay, I'll, okay, I'll no, hold down the barricade, I'll hold down the barricade. No, 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 no. Jay Schlatt and Quackity have a somewhat homosexual relationship. Before we go on, I need to explain the relationship between these two men. A common bit in the community is that Quackity and Schlatt are like a telenovela couple. We were playing last night. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Me and her on, the, on our realm. Remember our realm? Wait, actually too far. I removed your bed. <gasps> oh no you, know you the, didn't. the bed you put next to me? I removed it, and I made space Wait. for my new girlfriend's no, bed. No, you didn't! You didn't do that! Yeah. You didn't yeah, do I that! Did. Yeah, I did. Totally did that. Actually too far. I, I gotta get some- I made a deal with Quackity. If they combine their campaigns, Schlott would become the candidate, and Quackity would become the vice president, and Schlott would also take him back as his lover, or something like that. It's kind of weird. Wilbur and Tommy then retreated to Lamanberg to read the Declaration of Independence one more time, accepting the fact that they could possibly lose tomorrow. Election day came, and all the candidates of all the four respected parties gathered to see the results of the election. Wilbur Soot announced that in fourth place, Coconut 2020, 
had received 9% of the vote, to which they were extremely super happy about, for, for some reason. It was then announced Jayshlet had received 16% of the vote, to which he seemed pleased with, for some reason. And in second place, Swag 2020 had received 30% of the vote, and the incumbents Wilbur Soot and Tommy Innit received 45% of the vote. Thinking that they had won, Tommy was much overjoyed. Tommy, we won. Tommy, we won. But listen, 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 please, please stop celebrating, please, please stop celebrating, please, please stop celebrating, stop celebrating. George, come back up, please. Let's go. Please come back up, George. There's been a quackity already knows. I think. Tommy, 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 please, quite calm, calm down, Tommy. Tommy, Tommy. I, Tommy, please. I'm like, oh. two nights ago on the night of the election, oh. uh, after the announcement of Schlatt 2020 and <laughs> and Coconut 2020. <sighs> Quackity made a deal with um, the leader of Schlatt 2020, <laughs> uh, Mr. J. Schlatt stood behind me. Quackity said that no matter what happens, Quackity would pool Swag 2020 votes on with Schlatt 2020 votes. Uh, uh, <gasps> Og 2020 got 45% of the popular vote, meaning that the coalition government of Schlatt and Swag 2020 yeah. got 46%. Yeah. <laughs> No way! Yeah. Meaning that tonight, yeah. ladies and gentlemen, on Tuesday, yeah. the twenty-second, and as his first decree as president of Lamanberg, Jay Schlatt ordered that the men of the losing party, Wilbur and Tommy Innit, would have their citizenship revoked, and they were forced to flee to the forest. I said things are going to change. I looked every citizen of Lemanburg in the eyes and I said, you listen to me. This place will be a lot different tomorrow. <laughs> Let's start making it happen. <gasps> what do you... Well, but are you sure? You... My what? first decree as oh. the president of oh. Lemanburg, oh. the oh. emperor! <laughs> <laughs> well, but, yes, well, but surely sir. not. Well, well, is to revoke the yes, citizenship sir. of Wilbur Soot and Tommy in it. No! 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 Yes, baby, yes. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. No longer welcome. Get him out of here. Tommy, 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 Wilbur, 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 drink, drink, Wilbur. I'm Let's drunk, go, I'm drunk, baby. I'm drunk here. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Uh. With the banishment of Wilbur and Tommy, the former men of Lemanburg were forced to flee to the outskirts of the Dream SMP. Schlatt would banish the Lemanburgians and then make his first decree, declaring himself emperor and declaring that he would fill all the fountains with Hawaiian punch. Wilbur and Tommy, escaping into the forest, began a new commune called Pogtopia, and Schlatt would begin his first speeches. As Wilbur and Tommy were lying low in their new ravine, Technoblade tweeted at them, asking if they needed help. Okay. Look, come downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> good thing. I'm good. really good at After being alerted that the Blade had joined the Dream SMP, Quackity asked Schlatt if they were to be worried, and Schlatt replied that Techno was a sleeper agent, and there was nothing to be worried about. Schlatt then decided to make the second speech of Lemanberg, declaring that Lemanberg would now become Manberg. During this time, and in between, Technoblade would become homicidal, and the other men of Lemanberg would go over to ask for a visa and beg for forgiveness so that Tommy could show Ninja around for a day. This would end with Schlatt granting Tommy and Wilbur and Technoblade a one-day visa to Lemanberg. Free entry of everywhere with no war. There's war. War is roaring outside of these walls. No, no war being implied. Yeah. 
Just for one day? You want to be in my country? I want to be in your country. Schlatz. Why is that? During this time, Nikki descended from the current government, and Quackity went to confront her. This would end with Nikki accidentally punching Quackity to death. Nikki was then put in jail by Schlatt. However, Quackity later helped her escape. During this time with Nikki, Tubbo sleeked away to Pogtopia and was convinced to become an insider. While out there in the woods, Technoblade got some PTSD flashbacks from his old videos and decided to make a potato farm for 14 hours straight. I don't know how he does. Show it. me the farm. Show me the farm. Yeah, we, I've been I'm, working hard on the farm. I'm yeah. actually a little hungry, so this is this is good. Yeah, oh, okay. Now. Yeah, this is good. This is good. This is this is a, a bigger than I was expecting, but you know, I've seen what yeah, you can got. do, Technoblade. Okay. How long have you been on this? How long have you spent here? <laughs> uh, I haven't logged off. Wait, you. You haven't logged off the server from yeah, last I've, night. I've, I've just I've just been here. Well, that's like that's like fourteen hours techno. <laughs> At this time, Eric and Nikki were both considered helping the rebellion, but were interrupted by Fundy burning down the precious flag of Lamanberg. It's all up in the air. Finale, thank you so much. No! What? No! What? No! 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 This would lead to Wilbur disowning his son and ordering Technoblade to shoot him off the flag when he was rebuilding with a new design. Fundy then rejected completely Wilbur as his father, much to Wilbur's disgust, and Eric and Nikki began plowing, <laughs> planning to blow up the White House. <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> Rebellion is still going on, and we will cover those events in the next videos to come, but right now, uh, I've spent about 14 hours editing this video, so I'm gonna go to bed. If you'd like to subscribe, I'll do a next video on this probably sometime later. But I'm I'm gonna go now. I'm gonna.